wish, I wish I had my phone recording. Because she told me with the next verse, if it ain't broke, don't fix it. Me being auntie, I'm gonna tell you what your mama didn't tell you. You cannot be a bad bitch if you don't have a gynecologist. Bad bitches get their vaginas checked annually. Sometimes every two years, depending on what your doctor says. Sometimes every six months if your pap comes abnormal. I gotta tell you the facts. Auntie wants you guys to get your checkups. should have had my recorder on when I told my gyno about my, me taking the pills. I, I gave her an update. You know, you have to update your doctors on everything. The two people you don't lie to are your doctor and your lawyer, okay? You might have to lie to your mama sometimes, but don't die. Do not lie to your doctor or your lawyer. These are the people that get you out of trouble. So, I told her about the CBDT and she's like okay cool and i told her everything that was listed in it the same that i told you guys in the video and she was like well if you're not you if it's working for your ibs then i mean it seems like it's okay and then she literally looked up nutriburst she looked up the nutriburst plus and the nutriburst and she was like and i i told her like it's uh, a probiotic it's a liquid vitamin she's like it's refrigerated I'm like yeah and so she was like looked it up and she was like it seems pretty benign what's in there and if it's working for you and I was like well do you think she's like I don't see any of the probiotic stuff though Ooh. I'm walking in the Macy's guys and she was like I don't see any of the probiotic stuff and I'm like well, uh-oh, hold on, let me show you where I'm going. Water tower place. Look at my city in the Christmas time. So pretty. The water tower place is like a multi-level mall. It's so cute. But my doctor was like, when she said, you know, I was talking about the probiotics because she knows about all my stomach issues, girl. I tell my doctors everything. I do not play, you know. When you have them autoimmune issues and you've seen diseases for real, for real, I'm like, look, doc, tell me what it is. Tell me how we can fix it today. Check me for everything. And so, uh, she was like, no, I don't see anything wrong. Like, I told her about the Nutriburst. She looked it up, Googled it, went through all the ingredients, and she was like, well, I don't see the probiotic thing. But then she turns to me, like, look, if you are telling me this is working for you, and my blood pressure was great today, my weight is 148, I'm five foot two, I'm doing pretty good on the weight. Like, she said, if this is working for you, then I'm not gonna tell you to stop that. Like, I'm not gonna tell you to get on something else. Like, this is working for you, keep doing it. And I'm like, say less, the doctor gave me the okay. Both of my doctors have been telling me things. And then she did my annual think the thing that ladies need to get. And she was like, your hemorrhoids. 
doesn't look like they're there. They look gone. And she checked my uterus and she said that it was, it felt great. So I'm just healthy. I'm just ready to pop out them babies. Psych. Got a long time to be popping out some babies. But yeah. Yes, you see this is, there's levels to this mall, guys. It's like seven floors. I just want to go check Bath and Body Works and see what's on sale. And then I have to go get my x-rays done. I'm going to take you guys there for that. I definitely won't be able to bring my camera um, when I'm getting my x-rays done. But I don't know. I'm going to sneak. I'm going to sneak and see what I can do. Because I don't like leaving you guys out of my health journey, you know. Ooh, this, this place looks cute. Y'all know why I'm here. Y'all know why I'm here. This makes it smell like a damn Christmas tree in your house. Yep, I need all of that. Oh my gosh. It really smells like a freaking red velvet cupcake, guys. Crazy. They switched up the packaging for the same candle. Oh, they do such a good job. All right, I'm done shopping. I'm on my way to get my x-rays done. I don't want the whole day to spend it all the way downtown because I work downtown. So, who wants to really spend all day downtown where they work? I'd rather be at home getting some work done. I got a lot of editing to do for you guys. If you want... Oh, I really could have went that way to go downstairs, huh? Wrong way. But, I might show you guys what I got from Bath & Body Works. But it's really not going to be that big of a haul. So maybe I'll just show you when I get home. Grab a bite to eat. This pop-up called Sacred. It's a CBD. They had full spectrum CBD drops. This is a balm sample that I'm going to try and put on my knee later. And I'm just so happy that CBD is popping up everywhere as a natural holistic remedy, guys. I cannot wait to try. Look at how foggy it is at the water tower. Um, Total Life Changes has a CBD balm. I have not tried yet, and I really need to order some. It's called Alleviate. They also have a CBD drop known as the Harmony Drop. It's approximately 475 milligrams of CBD in each, or not in each drop, but it's a, 40, it's a 475 milligram CBD. So. Um, for somebody with arthritis or suffering arthritis pains, it's always advised that we go up. Like a 1,000 milligram is probably what somebody like myself or even 1,250 milligram is what somebody suffering some type of arthritis would be advised to take for CBD oil for it to regularly affect us. But for like stress relief and anxiety, like. 50 milligram 500 milligrams that's fine for y'all but for people that need that information lower we need something bigger and i'm always looking for bigger the spectrum i wouldn't buy their cbd drops because all they have is a 500 milligram so i've been actively researching online trying to find a better one which i'm sure i will find you guys are looking at the biggest Starbucks in the entire world. Just built. It's got five floors on it. Check it out. A lot of people come to Chicago and want to try Shake Shack. Shake Shack ain't nothing but a fancy ass Wendy's, y'all. Don't waste your time. I love some five guys. 
home for some butter burgers and then I already wrote an article on literally the best burgers you'll find in this city. So y'all should know better than that. I love some Shake Shack. But I love some fine guys. And the fries are really good. I, I gotta get that real meat taste. Shake Shack, you go for the shakes, but for the burgers, you might as well go to Wendy's, seriously. For fine five guys. Done. 